is this thing on yo what's going on everybody man it's your boy Pyoxis, and i'm back with another video now we do have some esbc newly changed the name to undisputed gameplay one full round new gameplay and this is something i actually tweeted i want to see at least one full round of gameplay um i have yet to watch this yet so put it in 4k and we go check this thing out man let's get it what is going on fight fans this is hey it works we're from Steel City Interactive, and today we're going to give you one full unedited round in Undisputed. I will be Ooh. on the left using okay. Nigel. Okay, so right off the bat, man, we want to scan and look at this again. If you guys want to watch the actual without any pauses or nothing, I will put the link to that in the description. But off the rip, I see they have a crowd. It looks like this looks like one of those. This isn't like professionally sanctioned. It's like in a in. Uh, warehouse type vibes. This is what the type of vibes this gives me right here, man. Ben versus my opponent, who will be using Carl Fry. Oh, this uh King Juice. This is King. If y'all guys didn't know, this is King Juice. Uh, now nah, just playing, man. Much. I immediately test my opponent's aggression by going to the center of the ring, then backing up to see okay. how far forward they will push and how many punches okay. they'll be throwing. So I can tell you right off the bat, people are going to complain, and it looks weird. It looks weird up to see how. and honestly this is one of those games you got to actually play to understand like you can you can eye test it but then you got to actually get on the sticks and play and um some things i see down here you see the uh the heartbeat the beats per minute and you can see right off the bat this dude's is 123 well he did throw a couple strikes but um it's the punches a lot of people are gonna i mean i personally i'm not listen i'm not here to be like Oh, ESBC this, ESB everything positive. I'm here to give constructive criticism. So right off the bat, the punches, I Forward, mean people are gonna complain with him. It looked a little bit weird, like that hook, how it how he swung it out there. It it can be a little bit weird. Um but how again, it's something that I just need to play. I noticed my opponent is incredibly aggressive. And uh personally, I think something like look at this hook. How are you gonna tell me this hook isn't So I'm throwing that hook, that lead hook is is I'll give them that. The rear hook, I think, could use a little bit of work, but a lot of punches to the body and to the head. I think what what's weird is um, a lot of people are so used to games and they have a lot of impact on punches. And again, guys, I know I'm going to be pausing this a lot, but please bear with me. And again, if you want to lead a video, by all means, do what you want to do. Check the description below and you can watch the original video. But, you know, in a lot of games, the punches you know you you get hit Had to try to slow him down ah see and i can see what people Throwing are complaining about punches like, to the, the, the body and animations and to the like that that overhand Had this overhand right here down i can you know, see that he blew his stamina immediately but i can again i want to say off the bat i do see alpha footage work in progress now there's and it's going to be a lot of guys from the ufc community they're gonna they're gonna talk about that animation right there right so, well that that's one of them but if you guys go into practice mode and throw an overhand with the rear hand in ufc4 and look, watch how the guy starts way back here and just slings it like she's slamming a basketball in a hoop and that's been like that for what ufc3 came out what it's like four years now so tell with the stamina nice. bar depletion as well as his animation I throw a few feints to further test his aggression, and I can okay. see that he is still overly aggressive. Feints in this game can be used by using the block button to cancel your punch. I'm also being mindful with the Philly shell. I'm trying to make sure I'm reading my see, opponent's see, punch. See, when they get in the pocket, you see it isn't like it isn't like a Rocky movie where it's oh, oh, oh. it isn't that. It's it's the pop you get hit with a good one, pop. And I mean, I personally. Personally, I like that rhythm and flow. It's just, again, I just have to sure play. I cover each pocket. Ooh, nice. The Philly shell Ooh, can be an effective tool as it blocks both the head and the body simultaneously. However, it leaves some pockets open. Mm. I then go into loose footwork and switch to the southpaw stance so I can give my opponent a different look, not only in switching to southpaw, but also changing up my tempo. One unique thing about this game when Orthodox is fighting a southpaw is that you can actually have a leaf foot battle because i like that people and i'm not a fighter but the importance of the lead foot means a lot that's one thing 
two, something that I wanted to talk about is a lot of people think every punch is supposed to be thrown perfectly, especially when you're in the phone booth with somebody, your punches aren't going to come out as crispy, and not everybody throws picture-perfect technique punches, all right? I just need you guys to understand that. The game doesn't force you to be in a straight line. You can actually move your character within a radius while being in front of your opponent. This allows Ooh. you to be positioned. <laughs> and he just hit him with like a three piece. Watch this. One, two, opponent. three. This allows and you to got be up out of there. <laughs> either on the inside of your opponent Ooh. or the outside of your opponent. And that was just movement to evade punches. Fighter. Unfortunately, however, I was losing that lead foot battle to my Damn. opponent. His opponent just walking him down. I'm consistently See? paying attention to See my opponent. See how weird it is? It's like. I like that animation. It's like the punches in the pocket. It's just, it's weird looking. You know, to the eye, it's weird looking. We're so used to these picture perfect. Oh, his technique is crazy, you know? And, and I respect that. I look at both standpoints. It does look weird. It does. It definitely does. But I'm not going to be the one to, to give them straight up hell for releasing alpha footage when I sat here and asked for it. His punch rhythm, which is allowing me to catch a lot of his punches on my glove, shoulders, and arms when doing the Philly shell. I'm also ensuring to switch to full guard while using the head movement and the weave modifier to cover any pockets or if I notice that my opponent Ooh. is on a broken rhythm. Notice how he stepped off the center line and made him miss. Rhythm. Watch this. He misses this right. He comes for it. He steps off the center line and he misses that shot. And a lot of these punches are missing literally because of footwork. He circles out. Ooh, three piece. I'm attacking my opponent while immediately returning back to the Philly shell. And I finish it with a step back straight right counter as my opponent continues. Also, another thing I think um something fell that I think is uh, also affecting this is the punches being slowed down. I think the punches being slowed down, and honestly, I'm a fan of slowing down the punches because when you make the punches so fast, you, it literally turns into a guessing game when it comes to re reading and reacting. Now, I'm not asking it to be so slow where you basically, you know, anyone can react to it, but UFC 4, when you add in everything with delay and stuff like that, it's very hard to react to certain punches. This is aggression. The directional punch mechanic not only allows you to change your punches, but it also helps you escape your opponent's attack at the same time. And you can see this man heartbeat, his heart rate is going up 176, so it's going up. At this point, I'm starting to notice a massive decrease in my opponent's output. And now I feel more confident to be even more aggressive than before. I'm I'm not gonna lie to y'all. I'm not upset with with this that just transpired. This this right here. I feel more confident to be even more aggressive than before. Can I ask somebody out there what was the biggest thing wrong with that situation? That was clean. In my opinion, that was fucking clean. I ended with a powerful sequence, which is a hard counter to the body, which doubles up to the head and see, a right hook see, to the head. Notice how when you when you throw those those flashy things or the sounds that certain punches make, it it, it changes the way the eye looks at it, bro. When you like, I know y'all gonna be like, bro, but that's listening. But you see the flash when you get hit, or you hear the the thump when they get hit. That really changes your opinion on certain things, especially with this game. I can see that because that situation right here, like hard counter to the body, like it's like you hear in the body, it, and then you hear you body, hear some thumping, doubles Listen. up to the head and a right hook. You see that? Doom, doom, doom. He hit him with a three piece. I'm gonna show you one more time. Which he is hit a him with hard a nasty counter to the body, which doubles this. up to the head and boom, boom, a right boom. hook to so the that. And then and then on top of that, you got the reaction, the, the head jerk. You know what I mean? Head to end the round. And that's the end of round one.
That was one full round of boxing in Undisputed. I hope you guys enjoyed that. And of course, there's going to be more to come just like this. See you next time. I'm not upset with what I've seen. I'm, I'm genuinely not upset with what I've seen. And I'm going to tell you why. Alpha gameplay. They're still working on the game. They're literally still working on the game. Alpha. Do you guys know what an alpha is? Just like all the people that they gave um, Rockstar hell when, when the, the GTA stuff got leaked. That's alpha footage. So I'm not upset there. Continues working on this. By the way, shout out to uh, Edward, man. Shout out to him, bro. He, uh, I think he's kind of like the big reason why this one round was played. And on top of that, he's probably the best player in in the staff of Steel City Interactive, man. Um, Boxing Fanatico, always my respect to him. Again, congratulations to him for being a, you know, he's in the development with the game now. And after watching this gameplay, I'm not upset. I my Honestly, I can't wait. This version of the game is unfinished. And I can I, I will literally tell you this. If this version of the game released, I would call it unfinished. If it released right now, I would call it unfinished. 100 percent But because it's they literally tell you and they're literally taking us through the progress of how they're doing this game. That's why I'm happy. Let me ask you a question. And then I'm gonna leave it at this. And I always refer back to UFC because it's usually the UFC guys that are bashing this game. Have you guys ever played an alpha of EA Sports UFC game or seen an alpha? I wonder what the alpha, if because UFC 5 is in the works right now. I wonder what the alpha looks like. I wonder if they release alpha gameplay, what would you guys' opinions be? I'm just saying. Now, I could go into details and talk about animations all day, especially fighter animation, especially with everybody having the same animations. I could do that all day. But what I won't do is drag it. And what I else won't do is to go back and forth with people about Undisputed slash ESBC. Okay? Hope y'all enjoyed this one here. I enjoyed it. Shouts out to Steel City Interactive. Always my respect, man. I can't wait to see, uh, see more gameplay and can't wait to personally get my hands on the game. And again, I'm not, I don't get paid to advertise. ESBC, I am a consumer, well, future consumer that is going to be giving my genuine opinion on the game, all right, whether that's positive or negative, and you guys heard the negatives in this video, you've heard the positives as well, all right, but I'm out.